I'm Tessa Clark. I'm a fashion designer based in Cincinnati, Ohio, and I'm on season 17 of Project Runway. I really fell in love with Cincinnati when I moved here to go to the Design, Architecture, Art, and Planning School at the University of Cincinnati. I started out studying graphic design at DAP. But when I was in graphic design and sitting behind a computer, I realized that I really missed the tactility of fine arts. So I made the switch to fashion, and it was definitely the right fit. Throughout fashion design and all of my internships, I realized that my strongest work came from when I was inspired by my roots and my upbringing. I'm from Greenville, Ohio, which is a small rural town. I am the product of two entrepreneurs. My mom's a potter, my dad's a miller, and I sort of wanted to pay homage to them with my senior thesis collection at DAP. I came up with the name Grind and Glaze, and my brand is an extension of that thesis collection. When I graduated in 2016 from DAP, I was sort of floundering and figuring out where can I have my collection and my pieces produced. And as soon as I found out that So Valley was becoming a thing, I was so excited. So Valley is a nonprofit manufacturing facility for sewn items. They really offer members and the community and sort of this whole region opportunities to have their garments sewn locally at a competitive price to New York and LA. They sewed my entire collection for my brand Grind and Glaze. It's sort of wild and amazing, the different capabilities that So Valley has just within a year of opening. Ida Wild is a boutique in Over the Rhine. It was founded by a local couple and then sold to my family in May of 2018. We sell brands from all over the world and we're really focusing on ethically made and sustainably made products. It's a really great opportunity for me to be able to directly sell my products to customers that come in the store. I'm so excited to be on Project Runway. It was such a whirlwind applying and wasn't even something that I was thinking about three months before it happened. But I'm really excited and I want to show the world that Cincinnati is a vibrant, diverse city and that there's awesome fashion things happening here.